Hey there, YouTube. It is your boy B3 back with another kicking action figure review. Today we're looking at a pretty cool one. It is the green Dino Charge Ranger from the Hasbro Power Rangers Lightning Collection. Yeah, this is a pretty cool one. Uh, I actually identified a lot with this Ranger. I thought he was really cool. You know, farm boy just trying to escape the farm. Uh, definitely identified with that. He was a raptor of sorts, a dromaeosaur, if you will. Pretty cool. Same basic sculpt as the Red Ranger with a new head. I don't think the Red Ranger had a hand like this, but the Red Ranger did have the back of the hands painted silver like the suits, and none of the Dino Charge releases since him have, I believe. No, I don't remember for gold exactly, but this guy didn't. Comes with a few accessories. He does have this cool pointing hand. And he comes with two different holding hands, one for each side. Obviously, you get the sword. I even displayed with the sword because he was a bit of a swordsman in the Sentai. And it is my favorite Sentai Zuden Sentai Cure Uger. Definitely check it out if you haven't. He'll also come with the Dino Charge Morpher, which functions as a blaster as well. Could use more paint. Am I right, folks? It's not even the same on both sides. Uh, we also have, you know, what the Lightning Collection got its name from. You can put these energy effects on, like, people's weapons. Neato. You got a fist hand for this side. And you also get the unmasked head sculpt. Cool. I display all my rangers. Helmeted, though. Yeah. But he is pretty cool. He's got good articulation. Up and down, side to side, there on the head. You got that kind of butterfly joint right there. Up and down on the arm, forward and back on the arm. You get the bicep swivel, a double elbow, a rotation on the wrist, forward and back on the wrist. Woo, you got all this going on. You got that waist crunch that I actually really like. In and out on the leg, forward, not terribly much back because he's got that bodacious booty. You got a rotation on the thigh, double knee bend. You got the boot swivel, up and down, and rotation. Plus he's got the two peg holes on the bottom of the feet. Very cool. Detail and paint are pretty good on this guy. Once again, I do wish the back of the hands were painted silver like they're supposed to be. The weapons could use a bit more paint. But other than that, he's good. You know, the helmet looks pretty perfect. This guy is just really nice, you know, fully painted on the back. He looks good. I just wish the hands and weapons had more paint. All right. Now let's get into s -s 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 size comparisons right now. I'm gonna compare him to a few things. I do have this Sentai Hero Series Super 2 Kaiger right here. I got it from a Power Rangers convention, so be sure to subscribe if you want to see a review of that puppy. Yep. Let's show him with another Lightning Collection figure like this putty. That looks good. Let's show him with some Common Rider. Like this Ginnem Level 10 Dangerous Zombie. Ultraman, you say? I thought I heard someone say Ultraman. <laughs> I actually didn't, but I am going to show you an Ultraman. Here is the Ultra Action Figure Shin Ultraman. Can't wait for that movie to hit the States. If and when, if and when. But yeah, that's pretty much it for size comparisons today all in all this is a good figure i'm glad i could get it for retail price you know i expect these dino charges to uh go up they are dinosaur rangers and those are always the ones that people want to get immediately so whenever i see a dinosaur ranger on shelf i'm like up oh, i gotta get that puppy i gotta get that puppy asap but yeah he is <sighs> pretty cool very cool actually so yeah that is it my friends thank you all very much for your support please remember to rate comment subscribe check out all the cool links in the description below facebook twitter etc wish he had a bit more paint but other than that this is a pretty good figure he's got good posability scales well with other lightning collections and as long as he scales well with his own line that's really all that matters right that's it thank you all once again i'll see you all next time